if you hear buzzing in the background, it's a fan of my computer that's currently on. I just am too lazy to turn it off. Uh, because I uh, right after after I have uh, made this update, I am going to watch the more YouTube while reading. Hello, people. My name is Eva. Welcome to a new video. And today, I am starting a blog. Uh, it is currently Friday on the 6th of September, so I had planned to start this vlog earlier, but uh, I just didn't feel like it. So now I want to try to vlog a little more again, because I think it's fun. I just have been very, very busy and it's been very, very hot. And I can already feel it because I turned my fan off uh, to make this update to annoy you less with more sound other than the fan of my computer um, but I just um, it's really really hot and um, I just wanted to start this video today and I will see how long I want to make this video go but uh, next week I have uh, a doctor's appointment and uh, that is um, and work and that is basically it there and my mom comes around weekend where we are going to make some food to store so we will see what shenanigan and gets up to but hopefully a lot of reading and hopefully the temperature falls down a bit because I hate when it's really hot when it's around the 20 21 degrees I I love that I really like that that's perfect temperature this when it's over those temperatures it's too hot it's just too hot and uh, I just hate it anyway let's come up with a wheeling update because I have actually read, read two chapters today of uh, children of fallen gods I have I am on page 180 so I'm this far into it and really enjoying it. I really, really enjoy it. I think and I even enjoy it more than the first one. So that is really, really cool. There's like 600 pages in it. Over 600? Yeah, over 600. So there's still way to go. But if I keep reading, it will be done in no time. I just know it. I really, really enjoy this. Um, I have also picked up I I picked this series up while I was not vlogging. Um, I did try to vlog a bit, but it was not the video that came comes way before this one. Um, is my wrap mid year wrap up. That's very very late, by the way. Um, but hey ho, I was busy in the mid year. Uh, I started the Warrior Cat series, uh, The Omen of the Stars, and this is a reread, and I have, am like in the middle of the book, of uh, the second book in The Omen of the Stars, called Fading Echoes. Really enjoying this one as well. I it's so f it's it's such fun time to reread. Uh, then I'm currently reading Volume Eight and Eight of uh, Full Metal Alchemist. I really want to finish uh, these two, Volume 8 and Volume 9, this month if I could. Uh, we will see if I ha in it comes in the mood for it, but uh, we will see. I'm especially enjoying this one very much. And there's cat hairs on it for some reason, and I don't know why. Uh, then I am currently reading this chunk uh, luckily this is three books in one so i'm only reading one of the books in this one this one is the legend of sigma trilogy um omnibus thingy by graham mcneil nile yeah, i don't know uh i am not that far into it so <laughs> and uh, the book is i don't know how long it is Around this long, I think. Uh, maybe a bit more, a bit less. 
Uh, but that one I'm currently reading into. And the book that I want to start, or manga I want to start reading, is volume 10, 11, and 12 of Shaman King. I don't know why I haven't started this yet, because I really love Shaman King, but hopefully I, I'm in a mood for it soon, so I can continue on with the series and uh, all that good stuff. My cat is speaking. <laughs> She has been very lazy lately, so also there's not been much walking with her, but it's, I think it's because of the heat. She turned one this month, uh, but I'm celebrating it in next month, because next month in October, in like around the 24th or 25th of October, that was around where I found her. No, it was earlier. And no, around the 16th or 17th of October, uh, I found her a year ago. And look at her now. She's a beauty. <laughs> uh, it's it's kind of weird and how, um, it's kind of weird how fast this year has gone, and how many f wonderful things have happened to me this year. This one is definitely, last year was one of my best years in years, and this year is going up to be even better than last one, and uh, it's just, it's just so nice, and I'm so happy to have Sora in my life, um, so it's kind of weird, but it's like, she's... <laughs> she is as weird as she used to be, and I just... I'm so glad that I decided to keep her because she had brought me so much joy. So hopefully she wants to go on a walk at some point. But yeah, that is basically my update. I will see you guys uh, probably tomorrow. Hello, it is currently Monday, the 9th of September, and uh, I have been up since 4 a.m. because who needs sleeps, right? No one needs sleeps. Uh, I have a cat almost biting my toes in a minute. No, you are not biting my toes. Um, so today's plan is that I am getting hopefully two packages today with some new books because I wanted to buy a gift for my brother and then I bought some gift for myself <laughs> because why not? Not because I have a million books I haven't read. I'm currently making some pre-made ice coffee because I need the energy and the lighting it is terrible but what can I do about it? Nothing. It's a rainy day which is very nice. It's been so hot the last four days or something like that that I have literally been sick. I just it was terrible. I felt because of my meds I get dehydrated really quickly and it was so hard that I could barely drink enough to keep myself hydrated um, which sucks that sucks a whole lot but there was something else I wanted to show you guys because I haven't really showed it uh, anywhere yet uh, maybe on my Instagram a little bit but I wanted to show you my new bookshelves because I got some of those uh, I have mentioned it in a, in a video I will post today actually um, that I have got but I have now where I in the beginning only had two bookshelves I have now five and it's so lovely I just love it but first we are going into my living room because I have made some makeshift bookshelves there uh, it's a little dark in here because it's early morning but hopefully it can get the point of across two seconds so this is my Danish bookshelf uh, all of these books is translated books or books written by Danish authors and uh, then I have my PlayStation games down there but this shelf is all made by old beer boxes uh, 
that um, from all beer companies in Denmark, and they are beautiful and they're kind of um, rustic. Is that the word? I don't know, but I just really like it. And if we turn around here and go into my bedroom, there is very dark. I am working on building one more here. I only have two old beer boxes for now, but I want three or four more to get up here. So these are going to be for my mangas and some books that I'm not grabbing to in two modes, but mostly they is for my mangas. We have a Sora. Hello, Sora. Um, so that is what is in here and then my pride and joy my five bookshelves in my office and I also got this one this one wasn't here before but that is more for my crafting and creative things and not really for books but look at this look at this ouch I have a cat biting my toes I will turn on the light. Uh, it might be a little bit clang, but I've thrown on the cat. But look at this. It's so stunning. And I'm not even, I haven't even filled all of my bookshelves yet. I am planning to do a book reorganization video. Uh, so wait for that coming. That is, that is the books I want to read before, or start before the end of the year. But look at this. I love it. This and that's my dragon shelf. Um, I just love it. I'm a game from shelf. Uh, it looks so good. And my Witcher shelf. Uh, I might get rid of these, but I haven't decided yet because I really like them. But I'm probably not going to read these covers anymore since I got these. Uh, and these are not made anymore, so the newest Witcher book that is on the way, hopefully, won't be in these editions. So I might get rid of them. I haven't decided yet. So... And there is uh, some mass market paperbacks and some just... Uh, Funny books, dinosaur books, and animal books. And there's my royal cat shelf, and uh, there's some roots of my shelf. It's been a few days since I last updated. It's around midday on a Sunday and uh, I'm just trying to relax. Yesterday I uh, baked and made food with my mom and uh, bought some new furniture from my kitchen. This pink one here. I've just ordered food and it's on this way so uh, when that comes I will just in the, the recordings and stuff like that. So uh, I ordered some food uh, because I just doesn't feel 
like um if you like making any other food i usually eat most so that is going to be my big meal it's a pizza <laughs> because i can't help myself i wanted pizza all week and stuff like that so um update on books i have been reading in the calling and I am on chapter three. I think I'm in, stopped in the middle of chapter three because I was so tired yesterday that I couldn't concentrate. Um, so uh, that one I want to today. I want to finish that uh, chapter. Uh, once I have eaten, I think I sit down and read a bunch. Um, so I want to finish that chapter, but I also want to go back into Children of Falling Gods because I really want to finish that one. I love it so far. I really have gone to love that book in the beginning. I was like, this is, uh, especially uh, with one of the characters, the new characters, Eva, Eva, I think her name is. Uh, I was a little unsure about her because she wasn't in the first one. And I was like, this is, who are you? I don't know you. But now I got to know her and the powers that she wields. I just, have come to love her so uh, i really want to get at least a good chunk into that one as well i want i'm soon at the middle point of that book so um so hopefully i can get that finished sooner or later hello a little bit of an update uh it's still sunday it's evening i'm about to go to a warm walk with my cat just rather than maybe some cream cool combat my acne problems but otherwise um, I found out something while I was uh, browsing the internet I realized that the book the calling that I have been reading a few chapters in in the past couple of days is actually the second book canon wise in the book series so uh, there's a book before that that I need to read first and I was like oh read that one instead so I have started The Stolen Throne uh, by the same author uh, I think three of or four of the books in the Dragon Age series so that one I have started um, I haven't read anything in Children of Fallen Gods I really want to I just don't have the brain at the moment and uh, now my cat wants to go for a walk so I will see you guys a little later. Hello, it is Wednesday. I didn't update you yesterday. I had quite a busy day yesterday. I was at work and then I was towards some gaming evening and uh, playing some dice and stuff like that with some of my neighbors around uh, this place where I moved to. Uh, but I have some packages. I have this one, which is a Kickstarter I backed, uh, and I will show you that afterwards because it's not really bookish, but it is about dinosaurs if you like that kind of thing. And then I have this one, a pre-order from The Broken Binding that I'm so excited to see in person. I'm a bit of a book bang ban at the moment, um, so I can only pre-order books and every three books I read, I can order new books. And since it's cheaper to order multiple, I have to read multiple free books at a time to get an order. So, or at least I will try to do that. Oh my god, I'm so excited. More things for sure to play with. She's already excited, can I see? And it's very well wrapped. I say that. And it's finely packaged. I love the way they package the books in. It's so nice. It's like getting a Christmas gift every time you order from Broken Binding. <laughs> Sora is playing. <laughs> oh, Sora. Never change. Oh, I see the edges. It is Between Dragons and Their Wrath by Devin Madsen. I have another book by them that I haven't read yet, but I apparently is a person who buys books every time there's something to do with dragons. 
um so whoops <laughs> but look at this it's so stunning oh, look at this it's so pretty and it is signed yeah the other one series that i have the first book for is the reborn empire series they all apparently have another series called the Vincian trilogy i haven't really heard of but uh and it's number 570 out of a thousand copies and i couldn't help myself but pre-order it because it's it's about dragons, so I can't wait to read this. Uh, Three people in a shattered empire belongs entangled in a lumen revolution in a sweeping epic fantasy full of dragons, alchemic, a chemical, a chemical, uh, I can't speak today, a chemical magic and political scheming and forbidden romance. I didn't know about the romance. I'm so excited right now. But that is that book. A little bit of a reading update while I package this out is I have been reading in uh, Children of Fallen Gods. I'm really enjoying it. I'm really loving it. And um, and uh, hopefully, so uh, hopefully I can get in at least to the middle point very, very soon. So the, the artist uh, that I backed the Kickstarter for is uh, Phoebe's. I don't know how to pronounce it, uh, but uh, they have an online shop. They do uh, dinosaur merch and stuff like that. So if you're interested in dinosaurs, I will definitely check them out. They're also doing a few comics. Uh, one is about wolves and two, the other two they are doing is about dinosaurs. So if you like dinosaurs, I will check the, them out. They are a great artist and I have ordered, I have ordered some commission from them a few times now and I'm really in love with them. Uh, so here we have some, uh, some dinosaur, dinos, dinosaur, dinosaur stickers. And that I ordered, and they are like this. They are going on my uh, TBR card for sure. But then there is what I mostly backed it for is these and um, no, sorry, no enamel pens. So we have a Spinosaur, we have a T Rex, we have an Allosaur, personally my favorite dinosaur of Allosaurs. Uh, we have a Dilophosaurus, uh, if you know uh, Jurassic Park, that is the thing with the frill. No, don't eat that, Sora. And lastly, we have a Utah Raptor, I believe. So they are stunning. I need a new banner to have them on, and I might make one myself. Look at this, they are so stunning. Um, I believe that you can get them on your sh the shop now, so you can back the Kickstarter and get them early. And uh, I just I love them. Um, I want to take a photo of them and post it on my Instagram. But then right now I have to stop my cat from eating something. <laughs> and that is all. They are really good quality metal. Uh, they have the pins on the back, uh, they're really nice. I also backed another Kickstarter from them, but it hasn't arrived yet. It's uh, still in in works. M&M pins is much faster to make and Sora is trying to eat them, so... They are so stunning. They're really, really pretty. Sora is a big fan of them, I can see, so... Uh, I'm so glad that I got these. Uh, this one is also one of my faves. Uh, I love dinosaurs, um, so I couldn't help but get them. Um, and then let's check out some of these stickers. They're also really nice quality. Like we have a Spinosaur and then it's foiled. It's really, really pretty. We have an Allosaurus. Let's see if I can guess all the dinosaurs. We have a Dilophosaurus again. And a T-Rex. 
a Utahraptor, a Triceratops, and a Stegosaur. I love these. I really, really do. I am so happy for these. I want to buy more from them. Uh, but at the moment, I'm trying to save up money for a new computer. So I can't do that at the moment. So yeah. Good morning. It is Friday around 7 a.m. I've been up since around 5. So <laughs> I woke up from a nightmare and I decided I didn't want to go back into sleep and back into that nightmare so I stayed up and um, this is the result but today is Friday uh, tomorrow I'm going to another city like three hours away with my brother to a family gathering so that is going to be exciting uh, today I know that a few packages is coming so you will get that update later on today but otherwise, I just uh, wanted to come with an update. Uh, I have been reading in Children, Children of Fallen Gods uh, yesterday. I'm almost at the midway point. This is uh, where I am now. Um, so I'm almost at the midway point. I'm loving this book so much. It's so much goodness. I just... I love it. Uh, so that one I probably plan to that or the stolen throne. Um, I have only read the first chapter, yes, of the stolen throne, and I want to read more of it. So this might come up again as a possible uh, one I could read today. Oh, I sh want maybe. I don't know, to continue the Hurricane Wars um, or Warriors. Uh, I haven't decided yet, so <laughs> it depends on my mood. Um, hello, it is Monday and um, I haven't updated in a few days. Mostly because I was at a get together with my cousins uh, on Saturday and Sunday I was just really, really tired. I'm still very tired today and but I got some book mail and I wanted to share it with it. So I got the paper deck bag edition of The Calling and The Stolen Throne by David Gardner, which is the the Dragon Age book that I'm currently reading. This one is, uh, they were much more tinier. It's a matte market than I expected. And I kind of regret buying them now because I'm like, why do I do that? I know that I have to buy the latest books um, in paper bags because I they are not in these deluxe editions that I have of this most of the series but they are also kind of cute I kind of dig them so I kind of regret it but kind of don't regret it um, so that is kind of fun I'm not, probably not going to read these editions on this I have to uh, because I have the deluxe edition and they're illustrated. Um, so that's my haul for today. I have more box books coming, but I don't know when. Uh, and then I should not have any books coming before next month, where there's some pre-orders that will come. But other than that, I am on a book bang bang. So every three books I read, I can buy new books. And that is the rule. I can pre-order books, but that is basically it. If it's not on pre-order, I'm not going to buy it. Hello, it is Tuesday and uh, I am still tired, And uh, but my neck and shoulder feels much better today compared to yesterday. So I have been reading a little bit in The Hurricane Wars and I don't know, I don't think I like it that much. Um, I don't like the main character. I I have only read one uh, point of view from the male character and I wish there was more because I like him so much better than her. I also don't like how it's, it's like she feels that she has a connection. I have to save my apple for my cat. Um, she... Sora 
It's my apple. I will talk while you have a cat in front of me, so I don't know if you can see me that well. But anyway, she thinks she feels this connection to this place she doesn't know or remember. And it's clear that she is from there because she keeps thinking about it and the connection. And it's just like, it's so obvious and I just, it starts in the middle of something. It's like you're starting in the middle of a chapter that's like, you don't get to know her. It's like, it's kind of like the author had these scenes in mind and just wrote those. If like starting the story in the middle of something. It's, that's how I feel. It's for, and I just don't know if I like that. Um, I like the writing style. There goes the cat. I like the writing style. I just don't like the story. So I might DNF this what page on. I'm almost at the 100 page mark. So I think I might DNF the whole game rules. Um, I will think on it. But I'm just not, I just don't vibe with it sadly. And I have kind of high hopes for it, but I just, I just don't vibe with it. So I, I think, yeah, I think I'm going to put that down uh, and focus on some of my other books um, and the other books that I want to start for the end. Hello, it is Sunday evening. Uh, I have not slept for 20 hours um, because I ran out of some of my sleeping medicine and, um, and it resulted in I couldn't sleep. I did buy, um, my doctor was closed so I couldn't order new one until tomorrow. Um, so, but I had like some kind of nature kind of things. Uh, pills that should help sleeping and they didn't do shit. <laughs> didn't do anything. But I have an update. So uh, Saturday, yesterday, I did finish Fading Echoes uh, by Aaron Hunter. I gave it a, a low 4 star. There's a lot of things that I kind of dislike with this book between two of the sisters as the main characters because they are they don't talk uh, to each other and stuff like that and I kinda hate that but it's kinda also makes sense to the plot so but I did did really enjoy this reread and I'm definitely going to continue on with rereading my this series so uh, then I started a new book <laughs> because why not and I started a curse of salt uh, by Sarah Street. Um, so this is a pirate romance. Um, so I have only read the two first chapters. I'm on chapter three, so I'm not that far into it. But I thought because there's some books that I really want uh, coming in November, and I was I will see if I can manage to read two more books so I can uh, order that book I want. Uh, to November, but that also means that I have to read two books in a month. So I will see if that even goes. If I miss it, I miss it. There's nothing bad about that, but it could be, it's something I really want. So we will see. Um, Hello, it is now October, so it's time to finish this vlog. So I had had a busy few days, so that is why this end of the rock it's a little bit late mostly because i haven't really been feeling well um and i have done a lot of things this week and uh, gotten a tattoo uh, went to work and uh, saw a so social worker so i have been <laughs> in my head i've been very very busy and i sleep so terribly i just need a good night's sleep. I really, really do. I just hope that I can get that soon. I am going to have some changes in my medication, so hopefully that can help. Um, so we will see about that. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, like, comment, subscribe. Everything of that is free. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.